two, one. Dion is here. All right. Yes, I'm finally so, here. So, if y'all need a vacation anywhere, Dion is your man, okay? FYI. Welcome to the Chocolate Bar Live. Okay. If your new boyfriend keeps old pics of former partners on social media, is this a problem? If you're gonna cheat, you're gonna cheat. But for me, uh, it should be where I will not see it. You know, we're all responsible adults. I don't really put a lot of information about me on social media because people are very nosy. Oh, that was actually your topic, Dion. Okay. Yeah, no, you took it from me. Overall, has religion made the world a better or worse place? As far as traditions, if you're in a situation where you're following traditions, then you probably will have a definite, this makes it better, this makes it worse. But from my experiences, I really don't follow a lot of that. Compartmentalize, so you can't be free of who you want to do and who, what you want to be and all. I look at the world from my perspective and what I believe in, but I'm not going to bash anybody for what they believe in. I believe that everyone in this world has something to contribute to each other. I don't stay on the religious matter. As long as you come with the open mind to hear somebody else's yes. side. Yes, love wins everything. And interestingly enough, that's what we were just talking about in church today, for Pentecost Sunday, how we are supposed to love all of our brothers, and not that I love you as long as you change. Does okay. top-bottom verse matter for you in a hookup? Does it matter in a life partner? Uh, mm. <laughs> For me, it's absolutely no. It doesn't matter. I don't give a fuck about that. Okay. You understand? Even I don't if you care didn't get to fuck, you don't give a fuck. Our reflection towards each other, our perfection, our ideas, the combination, the mutual contact and preferences that we have about society. So every other thing that I, I am top, I am bottom. On hookups, who says so? So okay. you were saying... It's a universal so law that everybody is, just wants dead. Want the love, the magnet, the connection, the mutual feeling that joins both of you. And it shouldn't be a uh, top or bottom issue. Mm -mm. What counts more is where your mind is leading you to. Oh, I don't believe that there is any masculinity or femininity because we're all fluid in our sexual demeanors as far as that. And for me, when you say top, bottom, and verse, it's about how you like to be pleased sexually. So to me, there are two different things. That's where we get confused. So, you know, a feminine top is like, oh, what is that? And a masculine bomb is like, uh, what are you doing? And then they also look at your masculinity and femininity and decide what you're good at and what you're not good at. And that's actually exactly what I just did, honestly, when I was like, you see this dude, he's all macho, and he's like, I don't want new bottoms. And I'm like... But he must be a top. But maybe he's a bottom. And like you said, you know, it's just how people like to be pleased sexually. When you're talking about hookups versus relationships, that's a whole other conversation piece as well. If you're going in for a hookup, if you're looking for a particular thing, say you're a top, then you should be hooking up with a bottom. If you're verse, you should be hooking up with somebody verse. And, and accordingly, if you're looking to just get oral, then you need to find somebody who's going to give you oral. So as far as hookups, that's, that's different. Then in a relationship... Now you're talking about pleasing someone for your duration of your lifetime that you're together. So now that's when you need to communicate and start saying, what do you like? What do I like? And that's all a pro part of the process of getting to know someone. I feel like if you get into a relationship with someone and you're not learning how to please the other person, then there's no point in you being in that relationship. Does top make any relationship move on? Does bottom make it move on? What pushes this ahead is love. The most important thing is that both of them are satisfied and they are true with each other. They love it that way. This relationship is not about being top or being this. If this is what you are, fine. This is who I am. But for me, I don't take being top or this or that. No, because I know within inside me, I cannot take it 100%. I'll know that the person that calls himself my top is someone's versatile or equally bottom. But what if they call themselves top 
and you know, and, and they're also DL. Again, this is based on a true story. And they're also DL. And you know that it comes from their insecurity with their sexuality.